the crucial role of pH in water parameters for caridina shrimp. Why is pH crucial in keeping and breeding higher-end caridina shrimp? We will deep dive into this topic and discuss its importance. Welcome everyone. This is Ray from RW Aquarium Pages. I'm here to share my journey in planted aquariums, shrimp tanks, and everything in between. Caridina shrimp have become a beloved choice among aquarium keepers, prized for their exquisite colors and charming personalities. Keeping and breeding these aquatic gems can be rewarding but a challenging experience, and understand the importance of water parameters particularly pH levels, is essential for their well-being. In this video, we'll delve into the significance of pH in maintaining a thriving caridina shrimp habitat. What are caridina shrimp? Caridina is a diverse genus of freshwater shrimp native to Southeast Asia. They're known for their captivating colors and patterns. Popular species within this genus include the crystal red shrimp, the bee shrimp, and the tiger shrimp. These shrimp are favorite among hobbyists due to their small size, intricate behaviors, and striking appearances. Higher end caridina shrimp, such as bowl and galaxy fishbone, are more sensitive to pH parameters than the crystal or the bee shrimp. Water parameters for caridina shrimp. In the wild, caridina shrimp inhabit soft, acidic waters with specific pH and mineral content levels. Therefore, to successfully keep and breed these shrimp in captivity, it's essential to replicate their natural habitat as closely as possible. Water parameters are a critical aspect of this endeavor, and pH plays a key role. Although on the internet, there are some videos that report the pH levels to be closer to around 7.0, so they might have been adapted and bred to 6.5. Understanding pH. pH is a measure of acidity or alkalinity of the water from a scale of 0 to 14, with 7 being neutral. A pH value below 7 indicates acidic conditions, while a value above 7 signifies alkaline conditions. Homebred caridina shrimp are typically thrive in slightly acidic pH ranges. The importance of pH for caridina shrimp. Replicating their natural habitat. Caridina shrimp hail from regions of soft acidic waters, often found in areas with decaying plant matter. These natural conditions have shaped their physiology, behavior, and reproductive patterns. Maintaining an appropriate pH level is crucial for the shrimp's overall well health and well-being and success in breeding. Molting and shell health. Caridina shrimp, like all crustaceans, require calcium to form and maintain their exoskeleton. In soft acidic water, calcium is more soluble and readily available to the shrimp. This ensures that they can undergo successful molting processes, where they shed their old exoskeleton and grow a new one. Maintaining an optimal pH level promotes healthy molting and preventing issues such as failed molts, deformities, and shell erosion. Reproduction. For caridina shrimp, successful reproduction is a key goal for everyone. The right pH level is a prerequisite for breeding success. Maintaining water parameters that resemble their natural habitat encourage healthy egg development and hatching, as well as the survival of the shrimp. Behavioral health. Caridina shrimp are known for their intricate behaviors, which include foraging for food and exploring their environment and engaging in courtship rituals. A stable and appropriate pH level help maintains the shrimp's comfort and reduce stress, allowing them to exhibit their natural behaviors and thrive in captivity. Maintaining the right pH for caridina shrimp. Ideal pH range. The ideal pH range for most caridina shrimp species is between 5.5 and 6.5, 
with some higher end species preferring values even lower on the pH scale. I'd say 6.5 is on the higher end and typically Caradina does better in a pH below 6. It's important to research the specific needs of your Caradina shrimp species you intend to keep as preferences can vary. Monitoring pH To ensure the pH of a shrimp tank remains within the ideal range, regular monitoring is essential. pH test kits are readily available and straightforward to use. Consistent testing and record keeping will help you make necessary adjustments to maintain the desired pH levels. To enhance monitoring this parameter, I currently use a pH monitor so that I can see the pH at a glance. Buffering substrates. Buffering substrates such as ADA Amazonia or Aquarius Neo substrate are specifically designed to lower and stabilize the pH of aquarium water. These substrates release beneficial ions such as humic acids, which create and maintain acidic conditions that Caradina shrimp need. You can use humic acid which is typically labeled as dark extract to help keep the pH below 6. The product I'm using keeps the pH around 5.8. Reverse Osmosis RO Water Using RO water as the base of your aquarium setup can be beneficial. The RO water is devoid of minerals and has a neutral pH. Then you can remineralize the water with specialized Caradina shrimp mineralizers to achieve the ideal pH and mineral content. Starting with a base of zero helps a lot compared to tap water, which varies. I'd like to add a few pumps of dark extract, which is concentrated humic acid, to the fresh water that I change with. Consistency. Maintaining a stable pH is essential. Sudden fluctuations can stress your shrimp and harm their health. Slow, gradual changes are preferred when making pH adjustments through water changes or substrate replacement. The challenges in maintaining pH for Caradina shrimp. While maintaining the ideal pH for Caradina shrimp is critical, it can be challenged due to various factors Local water conditions. The pH of your tap water may not naturally align with the preferred range of Caradina shrimp. In such cases, you'll need to adjust the water parameters to create a suitable environment. This is why I prefer RODI water with a base of zero. Carbonate hardness, or KH. KH is a measure of the water's buffering capacity and the ability to resist pH changes. Caradina shrimp typically prefer low or no KH levels. To maintain an appropriate KH, hobbyists use RO water as a base and remineralize to the desired parameters. Chemical drift. The use of certain decorations or filtration media can inadvertently rise or lower the pH levels. For instance, adding rocks such as ciru, crushed coral, or other rocks with limestone can increase the pH over time, making it necessary to closely monitor the water parameters. Biological activity. Biological processes in the aquarium, such as the breakdown of organic matter, can influence the pH. As a result, regular water changes and good aquarium maintenance practice help control these fluctuations. In conclusion, Caradina shrimp are captivating creatures that can thrive in the home aquarium when their specific needs are met. Understanding the role of pH and water parameters is crucial for maintaining the health and well-being of these fascinating creatures. By replicating the natural soft acidic habitat, you can create an ideal environment for your Caradina shrimp to molt, reproduce, and to display their natural behaviors. With the right care and attention to pH and other water parameters, you'll enjoy these beauty and the charms of these small wonders in your own aquarium. For your Caradina shrimp, do you ever monitor or record or notice the pH levels in your tank? Let's discuss this topic. I absolutely love sharing my experiences, success and failures with everyone. 
It's just so exciting to document my journey in planted shrimp tanks and to share it with others. Stay tuned for more informative videos as I've got plenty of content in store for you. Thanks for watching and listening to my rambles. I really appreciate it. Have an awesome day and happy shrimp keeping. Thanks for watching.